everybody. This is Papa Joe Dirt. Like this. I am in Arizona with a celebrity across. gold miner. His name is Woody. Right. He's been on the History okay. Channel. Gotcha. Uh, no. Looking for the lost mine. I gotta get him a table. He's teaching me how to gold mine. I gotta get him a table here. And we're in a creek. Okay. We gotta play a bit of show and tell again. That's the bank, okay? The okay. two banks. Yep. This is the main flow of the water. You've seen water running down the river. In the middle, it's always running really fast, and on the outside edge, it's just running slow. Okay? There's not going to be any gold moving in slow water. Okay. It has to be forced, okay? So, here's the fast water coming down. If you're pretty flat, if you're pretty flat, the gold's going to eventually get over here where it starts to slow down and start falling. And it'll fall like this, and they have a streak of gold here. The gold's not going to come over here. If the creek is tilted a little bit, then the main force of the water is going to be over here, and that's where the gold's going to be. Okay? Gotcha, gotcha. Now, as soon as it widens out from the creek, behind this bush here, going up there, it's pretty narrow compared to this down here. Okay? As soon as it, as soon as it widens out, if it's narrow like this, the gold could blow right through it. Okay? As soon as it widens out, the water slows down the gold will fall. Depending on where the gold's at, when it gets here, is where it's going to fall. If the creek is tilted a little bit, the gold could be coming across like this and could fall right here. Or it could be all the way over against here and fall over here. And that's why you look at the creek and see where the heavy water is and see where the water's coming down to be able to read it. That makes sense to you? Like these boulders. Right. This used to be the main flow of the water right here. Right. And I would put money on it. There's gold right in here. You see how that is all locked in, a solid dark rock? Yeah, right in this pit. I put money on it. Really? All the way down this whole edge. Put some gold on it. Huh? <laughs> put some gold on it. <laughs> I have people ask me if I, if I come out and I sprinkle gold on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> no, not hardly. I love it. Goes too precious to be throwing it down on the ground. This man is going to be a legend. Do you one have day. any questions about what I'm showing you here? No, sir. And I have the privilege yeah. of and learning. And if the creek is zigzagging, well, we. The gold's going to be doing this. Their brother and, it gets and sister. To here, like I said, and look at that beauty the right there. At. That's why there's always a reason where the gold's at. That that old myth about or the old BS about saying there's no rhyme or reason where the gold's at. There is. There's always a reason. Okay, on this zigzag right here. Uh huh. Look right in here. If it's coming around like this, now, you, you, you're talking about a curve now. You know, I'm not talking about a curve. I'm just talking about the creek tilting like this. Oh, okay? the creek tilting. I'm not going about a curve. Okay. Okay. There's a lot of difference between a creek tilting like this. The gold's going to continue to move unless it hits a slow spot and then it'll drop off. Gotcha. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Any questions at all? No. Sir.